Welcome to Rhinos and Aliens. Bonds with our parents. I have no clue. <laughs> I have no clue how we got there, but right. you know. bonds with our parents. Okay. Specifically. Gotta love it. Oh, this is gonna be good. Wait, Specifically. What? Specifically what? <laughs> oh shit. I think I know where this is going. I, I just wanna, I just want to say conscience. women need to contact have contact with their fathers to be able to connect with men. And the same can be said about men needing to have contact, be in contact with the mothers in order to connect with women. Fuck women. I wouldn't say that as a hundred percent statement, but I see what you're getting at. No, in in you're saying in yeah, general. In, yeah. in general, yeah, I see what you're saying. A better if a woman has a better relationship, better understanding relationship with her father, she has a better under relationship understanding relationship with men, right? Yes. Okay. This this came from the concept of daddy issues and i just i just thought daddy about issues, it mommy issues exactly issue issues so i just wanted issues you, is just issues your opinions on well first off bonds with your parents and do you feel like the bonds with your parents has negatively or positively or neutrally affected your actual relationships with that same sex i can't say this for everybody because i'm only myself obviously but i will say my bond with my mom is pretty solid me and my mom are pretty much very identical um like, we're really chill, really understanding, really nice people. Um, and I believe that has shaped me into the person I am today. Um, but, you know, um, my bond with my dad, I don't know my dad. Fuck my dad. <laughs> um, but that's life, you know? A lot of people around here don't know their dads. Sadly. Um, yeah, that's just the, the sad truth of it. But the thing is, it, it's literally per person. It's how you take it and how you respond. You know what I mean? Because there are people who get abused and they grow up to be abusers. And there are people who get abused and grow up to be protectors. So it's really on the person is what I would say. But I do agree in general, like what you were saying, where it, I do agree with the fact is because I have a better understanding relationship with my mom, I feel like I do understand women a little bit better than I do okay. understand man. Men, I should say. Um, and to I, emphasize, you didn't grow up with your father. No, I did not grow up with my father, no. That's me. Then that's me personally, because like I said, it's all a, a personal thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's how you take it and how you respond to it. So, do you think because of that, you? I know you said it, but you feel like you do. You're able to understand or relate to. I feel like I'm better. I I am better at understanding um, women, women than men. Yes, relating to. I I mean, I I can't really relate to a uh, woman. You know. Okay. I mean, on some points I can. On some points I can't. But I feel like. My relationship with my mom gave me a better understanding of women. Now, to go one step further, even though you understand women better, do you connect with women better or do you connect with men better on on average? On average, I connect with men better, but that's just because I feel like men are easier to connect to. <laughs> you know what I mean? So that's a different topic. Yeah, like, yeah. watch this. Yo, Donnie, you play that new game, bro? Yeah. That shit's fucking sweet, right? It is. Fucking nice. Me and Donnie, we're friends right now. This is true. You see how easy that is? Yeah, with how many women are actually. <clears throat> exactly. And with, that goes down and, more to mindsets. And it's, yeah, exactly. It's more about mindset. Like me and Donnie, right now, Donnie got a cool opinion of me. Even if he never met me before, he's like, yeah, he played that game. That's a pretty cool dude. You know what I mean? Yeah. But it's like, I'm not I'm not going to say females are more complicated because some are, some aren't. But it's like, On it's, average. It's, it's a whole different um, organism. You know what I mean? Where it's like, I feel like men, because we let things go much easier. It's, it's a different like, sport. Yeah. It's like straight up like, all right, Donnie's cool. Cool. I only met him once, but he was a cool dude. And then a girl, if you if she met Donnie once, she'd be like, "Well, I don't know. I only met him once. <laughs> um, I know he likes to play this one game. So yeah, <laughs> you see what I mean? Makes like they they, they kind of dig into it a bit deeper, where guys will just like slide it off, and it's like, yeah, he's a cool dude. You know, we, we talk, him play the yeah, game. Yeah, we talked once. He was a cool dude. Yeah, he seems like a pretty cool dude. See, it's simple for us. It's it a little simpler. And for them, they got to, I feel like they, they analyze it a bit more, it. but not, they don't all do that. And I know guys who will comp, you know, complicate it more, but on average, on but average. on average, yeah, on average, you women are complicated. <laughs> I didn't say that. I said it. I okay. So do it. Don, yo, if you could let, go with, go into depth about the dynamic between I your would mother say and father. With my mom, we have, I have a great understanding for women because of her, mm -hmm. me and her, we're not. No, we're close. I can... Well, no, we're close. I can technically talk to my mom about anything. Yeah, about anything. You know what yeah. I mean? You call your mom, you know your mom's going to be there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Now, father. 
You got one of them deadbeat dads too? <laughs> no. Oh, it's not bad then. He's mm. <laughs> he's not. <laughs> <laughs> I like you got one of those deadbeat bad. No, no, no. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. He's not a deadbeat. But he's, he's like, not he's much higher. Always, is he an absentee he's, father? He's like if it was a tear. You know, tear one is deadbeat. Yeah. Tear two would so. be like he's there, but like he in pops and out. In, yeah, in and out. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would say he's two. So he's more two ish. He was he he did get to tear tear five. He did because I lived with up him. Up to tier five. Yeah, I, I lived Dude, with I've him. Dude, I've been in the bottom section point. so long. I didn't even know there was a tier five. <laughs> yeah, you know. I thought there was like three tiers. Okay, we can put, we can do tier. <laughs> nah, 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 we can do no, 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 no. We can, fifth we can tier, do three. Dude, don't lie to three me. Three is he was there though. So yeah. I was I was I lived with him. You currently live my, with him. Uh, okay. Throughout my high school years, I did live with him. Okay. So I I experienced. I had a connection. I always had a connection with my dad, but only because. He, me and him is like really similar. Yeah, yeah, I get that. We play games, we play sports. His mindset is kind of like, like yours. Mine's. Yeah, similarities. It's yeah. easy. It's easier to understand somebody exactly. if a lot of things are exactly. similar. I get but that. me and him had a connection of a friendship more than parent. Yeah, I would say there's a lot. You know, there's a lot of people like that, and they don't they don't understand it. The yeah. difference. Yeah, they yeah. don't understand it at all. Like, yeah. yeah, I knew I know people who were like. Yeah, my mom treats me like this way, and I was just like, that's not how a mom does it. And they're like, I'm like, that's, I mean, a friend might do that, but it's like, you don't want, I mean, you, you don't want, want your mom to be your friend, but you don't want your friend to like be your mom. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. So it's just like, it's a weird kind of zone. So, like, but right now, he's back at deadbeat. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I mean, you know, at least you got yeah. some, you got some movement. Coming you know in what I mean? As conscience, I would say overall, going by a five tier, he, on average, has been a two going on a three tier, a one and a half. Yeah, between a one and a two. Are you talking about yours or no. his? Mine, yours. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah just because I was around a lot of oh, okay. the. Okay. So like right now he's, I okay. I know where he is. I know. I Question: do. do you know your dad's phone number? Do you do you have your dad's phone, dad's phone number? Phone. Can you contact your dad? Possibly. You could beat me then. <laughs> okay, but this is the but, thing. No, can, can I go for that real go quick? Ahead. What's worse? You don't have your father's number. You can't contact him, but he's still technically in the same country, let alone city. Mm-hmm. Or yes, you can technically contact your dad, but he is out of the country, mm-hmm. and he's in a completely different hemisphere uh-huh. on a completely different continent, uh-huh. and the. Basically, the only reason he's on this different <laughs> continent in a different hemisphere is so he wouldn't pay child support. I mean, the question is, does he <laughs> respond to your message? <laughs> hmm. You know, because here's the thing, right? I don't have my dad's number. But the last time I talked to him, he said I was a disappointment. <laughs> I, I love to bring up this story because it was so funny. Wow. Because the person who did not raise me said I was a disappointment. <laughs> you can see the irony in that. When you had a chance. So, obviously, fuck him, right? Yeah, definitely. But anyways, um, so he's like, he, he said that shit. And uh, then he was like, do you want to take my number down? And I just hit him with the, nah, I'm good. <laughs> and I just drove off. As you should. Yeah, you know, fuck that dude. Fuck him. Um, because my thing is like, even if I had his number, and even if I Nothing did text him. Change. Yeah, exactly. He is who he is. You know what I mean? Let me ask you something. If your dad told you straight up that. Um, the reason that you're a failure is because of your mom and that your mom was always a failure. How would you feel? He's a piece of shit. Exactly. Fuck him. Th- to the person that literally raised you. So it's like, dude, fuck you, dude. I just don't care. Like I'll, and he, my dad has multiple children. Like he has a lot of children that I've never met before. And I'll still talk with, like, if I, if the chance came up, I would talk to them. I would socialize with them because I don't know them. Mm-hmm. I, I, I base everyone. I don't base who you are off of the people you're around because there are people who, you know, like I'm friends with, but they have a friend who I don't like. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's just, it, that's just the way it is. You know what I mean? I don't have to be around that person all the time, so I don't really care. I'm not going to blame my, my, you know, my half brothers and my half sisters on my father's side because it is what it is. But as far as I'm concerned, I could not talk to my father for the rest of my life and I'd be cool with it because it is what it is. You know, I'm on the same level. Really? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, it's- He's there, like like I said. I know he's. I know where he is, and I can contact him if I wanted to. It's just at the same my, time. Actually, I think the I best way to, to say it is, 
does your father try to contact you? No. Exactly. It's not your job as a child to search for your parents. It's not. Okay. Your qu- parents' job is to be there. If they're not, they're not. Quick question, though. What if your father is technically contacting you, but he's only contacting you for inner motives that might make him... We're getting into specifics. We are. Yeah. We're going into Keep going, details. Frank. Keep going. Conscience. <laughs> might make him a richer, happier man. Okay. Then what, what's your question again? Okay, so... You guys saying? Wait, 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 wait. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's is why he I said calling? Like, okay, let's say he's ca- hypothetically. Hypothetically, he's calling me. Yeah. To see how I can make him richer. How he? How you can help him? But it's not obviously. It's not directly. But it's what, ulterior motives. You getting closer to him is going to help, end up helping him more. Yes. So it might seem like he's doing you a favor to connect with you. But he's not. Because you guys keep saying, oh, a father who doesn't call me is a bigger dirtbag than the one who does call me. But, but if he calls me to have a motive for that's, himself. Yeah, that's, that's selfish. That's even worse. Yeah. Don't call me at all. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. That's even I worse. I agree with Donnie Francis. <laughs> you mean con- You're c- c- conscious. <laughs> Uh, just conscious is in a, quite a pickle. Yeah, like <laughs> I don't as think, it always is. You I know, that's personally internal just dilemma. Don't, that's yeah. what spices up life. Yeah, you know what I mean. But don't, don't um, call me at all if you have your own. Just to be clear, everything like you guys are saying, conscience agrees with. But in certain it's, specific in, situations, he's in a different situation. Yeah, but yeah, Follow. I mean, but that's the thing is, <laughs> you can tell. That's the thing is, you're you as a human being, as a person, you've been around long enough, you can tell. Um, you know, what kind of, what kind of motives, what kind of people these are. And that's how you make your decisions. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like if I suddenly won the lottery and I got a text from my father somehow <laughs> saying, Hey, what up, bruh? <laughs> I'd be like, yo, <laughs> go fuck yourself. <laughs> like, <laughs> what's good, bruh? Yeah. What's good, bruh? Oh, you know, what? I'm going on, I'm going, I'm going on, I'm a going vacation. on vacation. So, you want to uh, come? And then I fucking buy him a ticket to Antarctica one way. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't have even bought that shit. <laughs> I would. I wouldn't even bought it. Hmm. It would have been a surprise drop off. <laughs> Yo, in in Jordan's situation, I it wouldn't be to Antarctica. It would be to hell. Fuck. Yeah. Well, just to the get back world to the topic, is in chaos. I understand women more because of my mom. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that is where this started. It, huh? it, it is. Yeah. Like he said, also I I can connect more so with men because it's I easier. am a man and we have similarities. Mm-hmm. Can I flip this real quick? Though? Absolutely, flip it. How do you guys think you would connect to men and women if your parent parental situation was the opposite? Was reversed? Yes. Do you uh, think it would I be think, so much harder to connect with women even more than I, it is I now? I don't think it would be harder, but I think I'd be worse at it. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> For me, I think I would be the same. You think you'd be the same? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so. I don't know. I, like I said, I feel like. Because like I said, my dad is like me. Or I'm like my dad, technically. So, so you're more. Uh, so you don't think your I mother think I would being just be more of a player than I am now, which is a bad thing. But yeah. So you, I mean, it depends actually. <laughs> so hate you're the more. Player, con- you hate the game, right? <laughs> exactly. You know what I mean? Exactly. You know what I mean? Mm. So depends. Hate the player, hate the game. That's I said, it. do you hate the player or do you hate the game? Yeah. Really depends. Perspective. Yeah. So I, I don't know. So you're more at least considerate because of your mom. Absolutely. Yeah. And you know what's funny, too, is if I, – I don't know if this is, like, currently, like, because of our location where we live. You ask a lot of people, like, straight up, like, they're the, – would you die for your moms? Yeah. Would you die for your dad? Mm. You know what I mean? That yeah. says a lot like, about Buffalo, bro. Yeah. Like, the, just because the location, like, I don't know if it's, you know, a it's thing. Probably, but, I would say it's like that. Around, but there like, are – the thing is, there are good dads out there. Yeah, they are. Like, you know it what is. was funny? The one time I was at Colton's and we're playing Cards Against Humanity – you know, just having a good old fashioned guys night and we're playing cards against humanity. And there was something that came up and somebody put down the cards that said, make your father cry. And then the second step was to profit. Right. Mm -hmm. And me and Adrian are laughing. And then Colton and Edwin are like, damn, that's fucked up. And I thought that was super funny because our perspectives were so different because mine and Adrian's fathers left us. So when it says make your fathers cry, you see it as funny. Right. And then Colton and father. Edwin had good fathers, you know, stayed in their lives, took care of them. Yo, that's a good point. Edwin that, is the complete opposite of us yeah, three. Yeah, that's why I thought it was so funny. I yeah. honestly thought it was so funny. 
So it just to me that it it's 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 it, there are good beds out there. We just didn't end up with them. No matter the the fifty fifty shot, bro. My mine is fifty fifty. Then thirty five. No. Twenty eighty. Fifteen eighty five. Seventy thirty. Seventy thirty. Seventy percent of my life he wasn't. Thirty percent. It's literally just my high but school. But can can we all agree that no matter the no, solid. Solid numbers. Dude. It is. No matter the sex, it, at, at the end of the day, the parent, it all depends on the personality and the character. It doesn't matter if it's of the, the mo- parent. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. 100%. Yeah, because even, like I said, even though my mom took care of me, it, my, mom's, my mom is a good person. I consider her to be a good person. If she wasn't a good person, I'd probably be a completely different person than I am right now. You know because then mean? both of your parents would have been shit. Exactly. So. And then there are people Comment who Comment no below. <laughs> what do you guys think? You know? So I really, it, but that's you gotta a, make the most of what you got. That's literally it. That's an even trickier situation because sometimes people with no parents, if their parents were both dirt bags, it, is if the child I know that's gets what I'm saying in a better situation, is that a better thing? Yeah, that's why you just got to make the best of what you got, dude. That's it. That's all you can do. Fuck it. Just a friendly reminder, guys. Hit the subscribe button in this corner, and then for the newest video. Then for the most recommended, and then for our famous dick pic.